It's Friday, April 18th, 2014. Hello, I'm Veronique Masterson. Here's what you need to know about what's happening at the University of Texas at El Paso. One lucky UTEP student is getting the opportunity of a lifetime. Leo Aguirre's short film, El Fuego de Tras, has been accepted to the 2014 Cannes Film Festival, one of the world's largest and most respected celebrations of cinema. On Saturday, April 19th, the public will get a special sneak peek of the film at 6 p.m. at the UTEP Union Cinema. Well, the film is made here in El Paso, and it's going to be screened a along with another one of my films called Back of Beyond, which won the Jury Award at the Aruba International Film Festival last year. So we're trying to get funds to go to Cannes and also um, find some funds for the Minor Film Society, which we recently established. So if you guys like to come out and support us, that'd be great. While the screening will be free and open to the public, donations will be accepted with all the proceeds going toward the new Minor Film Society. Aguirre is also looking for sponsors to help him get to the prestigious film festival in France in May. Go to utepnews.com for more information. Part of the UTEP experience is giving back and students here have contributed more than half a million hours to the community. That's up nearly 100,000 hours from last year. A portion of that time is donated by UTEP Greek organizations. Recently, the university hosted Greek Week where fraternities and sororities collaborate to raise funds. This year, it was to help children stricken with serious diseases and their families. Over the last quarter century, Omega Delta Phi has given countless hours of service. This month, the El Paso chapter celebrated with several activities, including a campus tree planting ceremony to symbolize the group's growth and stability. And make sure to get your tickets to the UTEP Dinner Theater's production of Les Miserables. The show premieres April 25th and will run for an entire month. Tickets can be purchased at the UTEP Ticket Center and all Ticketmaster outlets in El Paso. It's an exciting engineering challenge that was last at UTEP in 1998. Next weekend, 100 teams from around the world, including two UTEP teams, will put their Baja off-road vehicles to the test. The public is welcome to watch the teams test vehicles' top speed, acceleration, brakes, how well it can climb a rocky hill, and its endurance, and a whole lot more. Most of the events for the Baja Society of Automotive Engineers competition will take place behind the UTEP Student Recreation Center off of Sun Bowl Drive. For a full schedule of events and information about parking, visit bajasae2014.utep.edu. Finally, a big thank you to the thousands who made last weekend's first ever Campus White Centennial Open House a success. We leave you with images from this open house. I'm Veronique Masterson. We'll see you next Friday. Go Miners!